Here I have a U in labor. With my flock I like to intervene as less as possible and just let the animals do most of the work. So I'm just gonna stand by and watch. I can see the hoofs of the front two legs coming out, which is usually a good sign. Now the head is starting to come out as well. That confirms that the fetus was in the correct position. As you can see, she is struggling a bit. That's normal. Giving birth is no easy task. That's why it's called labor. But so far I don't see anything alarming. That's the what you want to watch out for. So far, the process seems to be normal. And here comes the baby. Welcome to the world. Again, I don't intervene as there is no reason to. The mother is quite capable to take care of her newborn on her own. I can tell he's already breathing on his own. So as part of making your homestead or small farm sustainable and resilient is making sure you only breed and use animals that you can depend on that don't need too much babysitting. So that's something that's very important for me personally. I only breed animals with good mothering instincts and that can do the work on their own as much as possible. As you can see, I don't use any towels or try to empty the nose of the newborn. Again, that's more work for me to do and less opportunity for the mother to bond with her newborn. And again, she's quite capable of taking care of all of that. I only intervene if I have to. And now that she's done, I usually like to give them some treats just to say thank you and show appreciation. And then I let her bond with her newborn for a few hours before I come in to cut the umbilical cord and weigh the newborn. And then I just use these clamps. And as you can see, I don't use any iodine. Uh, I don't think there's a need for it as long as your lambing pen is clean. Um, I make sure there's fresh bedding. As you can see, I use straw uh, right before lambing so that the surface is clean. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, 
please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment below if you have any questions. And we'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching.